brother, the MC, who um, I begged him not to do any Seahawks Broncos jerseys, but he did. <laughs> he was good. And Pedro, um, and actually wrote all of his jokes. <laughs> and um, should have been up there with him, but um, thank you both very much, not only for being that, but also for everything else you've done this week. Um, Asya, thank you very much. Asya, I'm sure as many of you know, is a person who likes to get things done. And all, um, all summer and all week, especially, she's been putting everything on the to-do list and really keeping me on track and meticulous attention to detail and um, just really helped me to execute my vision and I can't thank you enough. Um, and lastly, uh, my, my parents. I've had the honor of being able to spend the last two months living with my parents and it's kind of a lot thing to do when you are sort of in the shape of, I guess, like, yeah. <laughs> living with your parents again when you have a newfound love and appreciation for them. And um, I'm sure as most of the people in this room already know, they are two incredible, incredible people. There aren't enough words. Um, and if I try to put it into words, I would cry again, so I'm not going to do that. But uh, one thing, just to sort of paint the picture, my mom is the kind of mom who knows, who anticipates what I'm about to run out of toilet paper in my bathroom and she uses <laughs> and my dad is the kind of dad who has to say he's going to run out of gas in my car and it builds up to me. Just to give you a little idea of how amazing they are. And I also want to thank the Heather family and the Joffrey Kandan um, because just as amazing as my family is, you guys are too. And it makes me so happy to join such a big, loving, wonderful family. Okay, I know I'm rambling. There's one last person and he's standing next to me. And um, I just want to say that I'm, I'm so happy to be here next to you. I'm so happy to officially be your wife for life. And um, I know that together every day will be the best day ever. And, um, you know, one of the best pieces of advice I ever got about marriage is that marriage is like an island. That most of the time you're there alone, people come and visit the island, and you're but most of the time it's just you and your partner. And I know that our island will have sunny days and palm trees, but there will also be rough and rocky seas. And I can't imagine anyone else I'd rather be stuck on that island with. So here's to the rest of our life. Thank you all.